Supreme Court is hearing two big cases involving criminal charges against former President Donald Trump over the next two weeks. Next week, the court is going to take up whether the former president can even be prosecuted for his efforts to overturn his 2020 election loss to President Joe Biden. Today uh, in the courtroom, the justices heard arguments about whether a charge of obstructing a legal, an official proceeding, which is a charge that's faced by Trump and hundreds of participants uh, in the January 6, 2021 Capitol riot. The justices had tough questions for the Justice Department about whether the law, which was adopted in the wake of the Enron financial scandal more than two decades ago, can be used against January 6 defendants. It wasn't immediately clear in more than 90 minutes of arguments exactly how the court would come out. There were some justices on the conservative side of the court who seemed to favor a broad ruling that might prohibit the government from using the charge at all against January 6 defendants. Uh, another possibility is that the court could take a more measured approach and require lower courts to evaluate on a case-by-case -case basis whether the charge could be applied. Uh, the court's decision in the obstruction case is expected by late June. Uh, the court will hear an argument next week uh, in the case about whether Trump is himself immune from prosecution. And a decision in that case also could come uh, by late June, although the special counsel Jack Smith has asked the court to decide that case on a much faster time frame, which might allow a trial to be held before the November election, if indeed the court finds that Trump is not immune from prosecution.